Do you know I've just realised? My bedroom window has a little sticker in the corner saying emergency escape. I hadn't seen that before. <laughs> I've lived here like nearly two years. Hi guys, welcome back and happy new year. I hope you all had a fantastic time. We're in 2019 now. This is very strange. I mean, it's, it's kind of been coming, but it still feels strange. Anyway, today we are filming my What I Got For Christmas video. I did this last year, you guys seem to really like it. I've also done the What I Got For My Birthdays for the past two years, and again, you guys have loved those. I'll pop like the playlist up in the cards, or like down below or something if you do want to review those. But yes, we're doing the What I Got For Christmas 2018 edition. Both Adam and I were thoroughly spoiled this year, not just by each other, but by like everybody around us, grandparents, parents, brothers, all of that fun stuff. So yeah, so we've had some really great things. Some things I am so excited about and I've basically been hugging since I've got it but there we go anyway I hope you guys like this video just a quick disclaimer same as all other what I got videos that everybody ever does this is not me showing off this is just generally I love watching these videos like this time of year is like my crypt and I just sit and watch what I got for Christmas videos continually because I love it um if you guys obviously don't like these videos don't watch them it's not bragging it's literally just kind of saying what I got I don't really know what else I was gonna say about that so yeah that's what we are going to be doing today. Uh, make sure you give this video a, video a big thumbs up if you like it. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And without further ado, let's get talking about some presents. As you can see, I'm a little bit surrounded. <laughs> I'm not going to talk about a lady like the really little stuff I got in stocking. So I got obviously a lot of chocolate. Um, there's some little bits from like the body shop. Um, and yeah, like a weird cat calendar. I'm going to show you that actually because that's quite funny. It's a cat shaming calendar. So there's like a, one of these for every day. Cat shaming love it that was in my stocking from Santa thank you Santa along with a load of chocolates some Christmas socks and all of that fun stuff um, but yes but I am going to be talking about the physical presents that we do get from people um, saying that today is New Year's Day and I'm basically having a third Christmas today with Adam's grandparents so there may be a couple of pieces that aren't in here just because I haven't got them yet but anyway let's get started and I'm going to talk about extended family first so like aunts and uncles and grandparents so I'll start with what I got from my uncle and my aunt and they picked me up so cute this little Lola Rose box um anybody that knows me knows I love Lola Rose I collabed with them a couple of years ago and it literally made my life when that email came through my door I squealed absolutely squealed um, but I love the brand both me and my mum do and my aunt as well actually which is probably why um, and she just got me this really gorgeous bracelet um, I might do a close-up as well just to make sure you can see it um, and it's just got some beautiful kind of blues and pinky stones with some gold metal detail it's so pretty um, really really sweet and I really like that so that was very very generous and very very sweet of them oh, from one set of my grandparents we got so I have three sets of grandparents um, one set we got our big tub, our, our annual tub of Quality Street. Thank you very much. Um, from another set we got um, a joint present of like a big platter dish thing, uh, which is downstairs somewhere. Um, and then as like singular presents, they also got single ones as well. So they got to me um, this little another little bracelet. This is silver with some like blue um, gem detailing on it which is again very pretty and it's sterling silver and they also got me an internet password book this is actually going to be bloody handy for something like work because I have so many different passwords for so many different things and it is literally like all basically like an address book which is really handy so um and it's got butterflies on it and they know I like butterflies so yes very very nice thank you very much and then from my grandma she got me like a gift bag full of stuff um so i think one of the first things i opened was this so this is a 3d christmas cookie cutter set i am so intrigued by this i want to use this now even though it's not technically christmas anymore but it's basically you get like your metal cookie cutters but you get the bits so that they like slot together so they are like 3d cookies which is kind of insane to me and also quite exciting so i am very very much looking forward to trying those and testing those out I feel like that is either going to go horrendously wrong or really really well she also got me a candle so this is from Wax Lyrical it's peonies and jasmine it's just like a very kind of plain candle like this very Joe Malone-esque oh, it smells so nice it smells very like fresh and she also got me some of the um, Zoella slip-on slider slipper things the pink fluffy ones which i've kind of eyed up i've eyed up these style of slippers for a little while and like um and been like 
do I like them? Don't I like them? I wasn't really sure. Um, so I'm glad I've got a pair so I can just wear them and decide like how I feel about them. And then Adam's grandparents, so one set is the set that we haven't got our presents from yet, we're getting them today. Um, and then the other set, they got us this absolutely beautiful um, vase for our dining room. So they knew we all had a new table recently and they wanted something to go in the middle of it. I'll put a picture up, it is stunning. We are so pleased with it, we love it. Um, and then they also picked me up as a separate present, a molten brown cracker. So this is the orange and bermagant cracker. I do really like my like citrus scents. Um, and it has the hand cream in it, the body wash and also the nourishing body lotion. I've been trying not to open this until I did this video so I'm quite excited to open this now. Should we do brothers next? Okay, moving on to brothers. Adam has a brother, I have two brothers um, and they all have girlfriends. So it's kind of like presents from them and their other halves. Um, my brother-in-law um, got us a joint present of Game of Thrones Risk. Risk is not a game I'd ever played before, so I definitely think it was probably more suited to Adam, but we did play on Christmas Day and I won. And me and Adam love Game of Thrones, he knows that, so it was actually a very good present for us. So yeah, that was really, really great. Um, and then my brothers, so my younger brother and his girlfriend and their little boy Noah. Um, so Noah is my nephew, he's nine months old, cutest thing in the world. Um, they got a separate presents and then a joint present separate present. Kate, by the way, is the one that was in my video a few weeks ago. I'll pop it in the cards of like the um, 10 minute makeup challenge. Definitely check her out if you haven't already. I'll link her um, on the screen now. But she, or well, they got me, I'm guessing it's more to do with her than him. Um, the One of the MAC Shiny Pretty Things um, mini glitter and pigment sets. And this is the gold set. I've never used their um, loose pigments before so I'm so excited to try these I'm definitely going to do a video like first impressions on these but they just like the colours in this I don't know how you can see it but they are just stunning so pretty so we have two pigments so two pigments on either end here and they've got the two middle ones are glitters so yeah I am very excited to try these out and test them I think they're going to be a lot of fun um and I love the fact that it's something I haven't tried before um so yeah I'm very excited and then as a joint present, they got us. So my little nephew Noah obviously had a little photo shoot a couple of months ago. And they did this for everybody, but they made us a 2019 calendar. Um, so that is my little nephew there. And in each like month, he's doing something really cute. That's my mum's bear, by the way, <laughs> called Brian from Build the Bear Factory. Um, look at this one, he's so cute. Um, I love it, I'm obsessed with this, it's so, so so cute he's adorable so yeah I love that I think that was such a good idea it's such a good present um yeah I love it I think it's great it's one of my favorites and then my older brother and his girlfriend kind of went to town they we saw them on boxing day and they were like this pile of presents on my mum and dad's coffee table and I was like I'm guessing they're for like me and Adam so I was like dividing them up and I was like there's like five here for me yeah I was like what have you bought me um but yeah they very spoil us so one of the things they got which they did wrap separately was these beautiful glasses so they've got like the hammered metal bottoms i've always eyed these glasses like not these specific ones i'm sure but ones like this i've always kind of eyed them up i know all of the bonus do them um and kind of thought like oh they're really really nice but i don't know if like i don't know i've never like got them these have got more like a pinky tone which are beautiful i really really like these um they are drinking glasses and i think i'm assuming they're drinking glasses because they say hand wash only but they are so beautiful i really really like them they're kind of like a coppery pinky but yeah they're really pretty i like those a lot um they also got me a couple of little bits from body shop so a hand cream and also a um raspberry lip but i've got a really itchy nose now i've got like dust on my nose so yeah, this is from like their Berry Bonbon one, which is one of the new ones, which I do already have, but I love the scent, so I'm really pleased when I got two of them. Um, they also got me a leather journal, so this is just like a metallic -y one. Um, yes, they also got me a pair of earrings, which are from a company called Stella and Dot, which I hadn't heard from before. They're so pretty, they're just like big gold kind of triangle square he's not triangle they're squares um, and then Adam actually pointed out that they're very similar to the ring he got me for my birthday in terms of shape um, so I don't know if that was on purpose or not but either way I twisted it those are really pretty I like those a lot I would definitely be getting a lot of wear out of them because 
I'm loving my gold jewellery at the moment. So we can move on to parents. So I will start with my parents-in-law. Um, first of all, they gave us all of our presents in one of these each, which I think these are so gorgeous. Adam's not a stocking person. He was like, I don't want it. I was like, bar humbug, it's going to be a decoration. Um, so yeah, I've got an L, he has an A. Um, and apparently she went into Marks and Spencers, which is where I believe she got them from. And the letters they had left, they only had an L, an A, an R, and a J. And their son is called Rogan and his girlfriend is Jenna. So it was like all the letters that they needed. So that was handy, but I really like that. And then in terms of presents, um, so they got me Gino's Italian Coastal Escape, so the recipe book, I believe, I think this was a TV series. Um, so they got me the recipe book to go with that. Me and Adam love Italian food, so we'll definitely probably be trying some bits from that. Um, they got me a apron with a load of cats on it. Oh, there's a little ginger one on this side, that's so cute. Um, she actually has one very, very similar to this. Um, I think it's got owls, I think it's got owls on it because she loves owls, but this has got cats all over it, so very, very handy. I really like that. Um, and then she also got me um, four of the look, ooh, four of the little White Company Winter Star Tea Lights, that's what I'm to think of. I love this scent, like, my house is full of this scent at the moment downstairs, um, but I really like it, and these are so cute, they're really pretty. Um, their cat got me an Erase Your Face reusable makeup removing cloth. I have not used one of these before, so like I don't know if it's any good. She said as well, she's like, I don't know if it's any good. Um, but Adam's gonna be really happy because I keep ruining our flannel at the moment with makeup. So yeah, happy, really, really pleased with that. Um, and then they also got me um, the Chanel Chance Sheer Moisture Mist, and this is the um, O Fresh one. So. If you saw my what I got for my birthday video, then you would have seen that I got like all of the O Fresh other pieces from my mum and dad. So I got the um, perfume, the moisturiser, and also the shower gel. Um, it's like my favourite Chanel fragrance, so I know I'd run out of it. So they repurchased a lot of that for me, and yeah, they put me up the sheer moisture mist, which I didn't know was a thing. So I am very excited to try this out and see what it actually does because I've never used one before. So yes, and then. One of my absolute favourite presents. So excited about this. this. was a complete surprise. Was not expecting this at all. If you know what this is, then you know. Um, they got me and Adam annual, an annual um, pass to Marwell Zoo, which is a zoo very close to us. And it's like 20, 25 minutes drive away. We go every year on my birthday. Uh, we both love zoos anyway. Like, whenever we go on holiday, we're always going to a zoo. Like, if there is one there, we're like, I'm like, Adam, we're going to the zoo, we have to go to the zoo. I love zoos. Um, so I am so excited about this. We are going, oh, we've, I've heard this before, so it's hard. We went New Year's Eve um, because we needed to go to set up the membership anyway to get all our photos and stuff done. Um, but it gives us like lots of other perks as well. Um, but yes, I am so excited about this. I was just hugging this on Christmas Day because I was like, oh, it's mine. Adam's like, it's mine too. I was like, meh. It's mine. I'm going to Marwell. Um, yeah, I loved this present. It was a really, really good one. Very, very happy with that. Okay, so moving on to my parents. As usual, thoroughly spoilt um, by my parents. Um, they did get me a pair of the black Journey jeans from Topshop. I'm kind of wearing them, so I can't really show them to you. Um, I had the blue, the black, and the grey pair, and literally in the past two months, all three have split or broken or got holes in them. Um, <laughs> And I am very, very happy to have the black pair back in my life. I was, I've been wearing them non-stop since I got them. I was like, I missed having black jeans. They're just so nice. Um, so yes, yeah, so they got me the black jeans. And then um, they got me a few other bits. So one of the bits they got me was a new Pandora charm. And it's um, the Olaf um, one. Again, I'll do a close-up so you can see this properly. But it's got a little, little Olaf. And it's got... Um, I like warm hugs on it as well, which is so cute. I always tend to get like a Christmassy um, Pandora charm for Christmas, which is nice. So that's really sweet. Yes, so the other, they also got me a couple of other jewellery bits from Olivia Burton, um, which I've had a few bits from Olivia Burton lately because I've kind of had a little bit of love affair with them. But um, these two bits go together. So they got me the Open Bee Bangle in Rose Gold. It's so pretty. I have been wearing this non stop since I've got it, and I've this should be one of those like I don't know how I feel about wearing rose gold, but I'm obsessed with this. It's so pretty. And my Olivia Burton watch the metal work on that is rose gold as well, so it just goes really nicely with that. 
Um, and then to go with them, they got me the um, little bee rose gold studs as well. And they've got little gems in the bee's body. And with this, again, I'll do a close-up so you can see them properly. Ah, don't, don't fall. Don't fly away. Don't fly away. Um, but yeah, Adam's been calling these my little snitch earrings because he thinks they look like a snitch from Harry Potter. Which I get, actually. I do get. Um, but yes, I feel very spoiled with those pieces. They didn't stop there either. So, we've also got some smellies, some makeup, and a new purse. So, for the smellies, I'll do those bits first. So, they got me one of the gift sets from um, Lush. I threw away, like, the outer packaging, so I can't remember what it was called. But in here, I love Lush bath bombs and stuff, so I was very happy. But in here, we have the um, bath bomb. So, we've got the Butter Bear. Um, we've got the reusable bubble bar in candy cane and we've also got the bath melt which is the starlight star bright one so you can't see these too well in there um let me see if i can get these out so we've got the candy cane here which looks incredible um we have the um butter bear just here that oh, smells so nice and then we've also got a very silver bath melt star there so i'm so excited to try these because I ran out of Lush bath bomb stuff a little while ago and I've been testing some other bits out and they just smells nice. It smells nice, so I'm very excited about those. And then, I mean, technically Santa got me this in my stocking, but it's a little Joma, it's the Joma Lake handle. I got one of these last year as well. Um, so in here you've got the Red Roses Cologne, the English Oak and Red Currant Body and Hand Wash, which I love that scent, I have the fragrance for it. Um, and the Big Body Wash, obsessed with it. Oh, and also, yeah. That was like the thing I got last year. Um, and then the Lime, Basil and Mandarin Body Creams. Yeah, I'm now excited to open this up. Open up my cracker and try that out. So again, thank you, Santa. Um, and then they also got, this is a fragrance from German Line that I have been umming and ahhing about four years. This was my other potential wedding scent. And I ended up going for the Peony and Blush Suede instead. And ever since I've just been umming and ahhing about this and I now have it and I'm so happy. Um, it is the Nectarine and Blossom, no, Nectarine Blossom and a Honey Cologne from Jo Malone. It smells insane. Oh, I haven't put any on today. It's so nice. I sprayed myself with it when I got it and I'm now obsessed. It's definitely more of like a spring summer fragrance. It's very light, it's very fresh, it's very citrusy. Um, and I'm just so happy I have it in my life now. I'm so excited. This is definitely one of my favourites. Um, and then I got a couple of makeup bits, which again, I have been using and I'm very excited about this. So the first one is the Urban Decay Born to Run palette. This is one that I have been, again, after for a little while and I was going to buy it for myself and then I thought I've got a birthday and Christmas coming up, so I'll wait. Um, like this packaging, I'm not that fussed about, but the colours in here are just stunning. They're so pretty, so beautiful. I've been playing around with them. They've got like the normal Urban Decay, like quality to the eyeshadows. I'm definitely going to be doing a video with these very very soon. And then the other makeup bit that they got me was the MAC Shiny Pretty Things Lip Kit. So this is basically the one that has all 10, their top 10 best sellers in like mini form. I mean how pretty does this look? This just looks insane. And yes, I have already been testing these. And again I'm going to do a full video on all of these, just kind of doing my hits and misses from what's in here. This one is chilly, which is what is on my lips today. Really, really like the tone of that. But yeah, I love this. I am obsessed. So obsessed. And I'm actually very impressed by like the size of these because even though they're minis, they're not. I was a little bit worried that they would be so mini you like would lose them really easily. But the size of them is not that much smaller than a normal MAC lipstick. And then my kind of main present from my parents was a new purse because I haven't had one in about four or five years. Um, and there was one in particular that I really wanted from Radley, which they got for me. So it comes in its very pretty little Radley dust bag. And then it's got Wild at Heart on the front here, and it's just navy, obviously. Um, and it's got some lovely pinks and greens, and you've got like your Radley dogs. It's so pretty, really pretty. I like that a lot, and I can now swap everything over. Now that I've done this video. So yes. Very, very nice. I like that a lot. Like I said, parents have already spoiled me again this year. And then last but by no means least, we have Adam here. If you don't know, is my husband. And again, he did pretty well. He spoiled me. And one of my favourite presents is, actually, a few of my favourite presents is from this. So the first thing 
is a pastry brush, which there is a little bit of a story behind this, but he got me a pastry brush because he was making lemon drizzle, no, he was making some sort of cinnamon bread thing, and he was like, do we have a brush to like brush something over the top of the bread? And I was like, no, I don't think we do. So he was like, oh, I'll get a pastry brush, and I literally found my pastry brush on Christmas Eve. And I was like, oh, we do have a pastry brush, by the way. I found it, and then I opened this on Christmas Day, and he was like, yep. I was like, it's handy to have two. We can have two pastry brushes, it's fine. Um, so yes, we now have two pastry brushes. He also got me, uh, oh, he also got me some underwear from Calvin Klein, which I'm not really gonna show you because I feel like it's weird showing random people on YouTube my underwear. But um, it's very nice, he did very well, and apparently I needed new underwear. So thanks, Ad, new underwear. Um, he also got, he also got me, well actually Fred got me um, some gloves, um, which is going to use with my main present from Adam. Um, I didn't have any gloves, and I'm always losing gloves, so they got the two pack. So I now have four gloves. So I hopefully should not use those, but they're really soft, really lovely. And then one of the things that was like a huge surprise, and I love it, is a print. Um, it's this one here, so it's a load of quotes from friends. Um, which is like my favourite TV show and like when I got in the morning I was like who says this one, who says this one and I was quizzing him he was like how do you know this and then I was like and there was also like oh this is from this episode or this is from this series he's like these are sad um, but he also got it done in a colour that my office um, is going to be in so my office is going to be greys and yellows um, so he obviously thought that one through plus the fact that he was obviously saying this is going in your office and nowhere else um, so yeah, I just need to get like a frame for this to match the one that I've already got in my office which is in the background of my usual videos with the Hendrix bottle and um, so it'll just be like a plain black frame but I'm really really like that, I was very impressed with that one. And he also got me, and this is something I'm so glad we managed to find because on the website I found them and I was like, because he had some budget left over and he was like, I'll oh, have a look to see what you want. And I went onto the Misoma website because I thought I'll find something that kind of goes with this necklace but maybe like a little shorter to layer it. And then I found these earrings and I was like, I love them, I want them. And he went to order them and they were sold out. And he was like, see if you can find something else. And I was like, I can't find anything else I like as much as these earrings. So I ended up just Googling the earrings and we found them online um, and available on another website. I think it was Fortnum and Mason. Um, so he got me some Misoma earrings and they're like the gold hoop ones but they're hammered so again I'll do a close up um so they are like the medium size so they're a pretty good size and then they're kind of hammered around the edges I don't know how well you can see that so it gives like a little bit of texture it's just something a little bit different and I really really liked them and I loved the size of them and I'm obsessed I've been wearing these non-stop these are definitely one of my favorites um my favorite presents they are beautiful and I love them a lot they're really, really pretty. And then last but not least, it was my main present from Adam. One of my favourites, I keep hugging it and I keep putting it on because it's so comfortable. Um, it's a new coat. Apparently he wanted to get me a new coat because he didn't like my old coat. And also, to be fair, I needed a new one and a proper one because I've always bought coats for like how they look rather than function, which means they're not that warm and they usually don't have a hood and they're not that waterproof. Fred, do not jump on that windowsill. So. We went shopping and we went to Super Dry and we found me one and it is gorgeous. So it's this red one. We found it in the outlet in Gunworth, so don't know if it's still available online. Um, but yeah, it's red, it's really thick, it's so soft and cozy on the inside. It's got all these toggles, it goes like just past my bum, so it's still long. Um, it's got like the furry hood, which is all like like Sherpa, I don't know what you call that, Sherpa kind of style on the inside of the hood but it's honestly so comfortable so warm i'm obsessed with it i really like it um so yeah it's like i love this coat it's so good okay so that is finally <laughs> everything um i hope you guys enjoyed this and i hope you guys have thoroughly bought the spoiled this christmas as well let me know what your favorite thing is that i got from christmas pop that in the comments below and let me know what you got for christmas as well I'd, i'm so nosy i love to know what people got for christmas so pop that below for me and yeah if you like this video, again, make sure you give a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Please come back again for a new video on Friday where I'm going to be doing the hits and misses from my Body Shop Advent calendar that I had over December. And yeah, thank you very much again for joining. Thank you so much for all of your support in 2018. It's meant so much. And yeah, here's to a fantastic 2019. Bye.